haven't seen the champagne. You and Charles drank it. Oh. I need something special for Debbie's hendo. Oh, Charles invited you. That's great. Well, normality is just what we need to silence the gossips. You should ask Bernice out again. Yeah, you see my pills? Well, they'd be wherever you left them. You shouldn't put your life on hold for me, you know. Yeah. yeah. Right, we're going to go into town. Why do I have to go? Because I have a splitting headache and I need you to carry Mum. Oh, thank you. Denise, what a bonus. I was hoping you might agree to another dinner date sometime. Oh, only if you let me cook. I promise not to poison you. <laughs> Debbie, Mum asked me to take loads of pictures. She's good, she's not here. Oh, yeah, take some charity as well, would you? She's here in spirit, love. Yeah. Oh, she'd be delighted. Even more use than she ever was. No, you won't feel that way forever. Thanks. I'm glad you let me be your stepmom at last. Well, just don't tell my dad that I'm going soft. <laughs> well, ours, ex, Barton, Dingle, whatever's need to stick together. Don't you forget it. Right, another bottle we need for a start. I suppose the other girl is getting married tomorrow. Yeah! What are you doing, man? Still Japanese? <laughs> Get lost. Don't worry, I'm going. Enjoy. Hey, you're right. You're right. Yes, so Carl, I finally let you go then. Laurel's missed you. Are you uh... still divorcing? Still yeah, living yeah. together? Same old school. <laughs> yeah! Sort it up, bro. You're disgracing the family. Hey, good to see you. Hey, easy, fellas. The folks trying to have a peaceable drink in this town. Hey! I am gonna kill you lot for this. You want a real rodeo, lads? I got a bucking bronco for art. Are you sure wagons that are crushing my wedding meat? Albert Figgis, Europe's number one travelling funfair. Yeah. Yeah. Must have taken a wrong turn, mate. Oh, quick pit stop for a few essential repairs. Yeah. Hey, we'll have to let the kids have a go before you leave, though. Sarah would love that. If you need any assistance, I do have experience with bouncy castles. So you're saying you could set it up here for us? Yeah, of course. What a fair for me. Wedding day, lads, what do you reckon? We could move the street party to the village hall. Yeah, up the island of Dodgeon. Yeah. Take a dead goldfish home. Well, ah! oh, oh. get the boys to sort it out. We'll agree terms later. Yeah, yes. so me. Oh, it wins yet again. Typical. Listen, mate, I, uh, I had that check for you. Grandad's watch. Oh, for the firstborn. How oh, touching. Listen. If you don't like it, then go. Or I can chuck you out myself. <laughs> <laughs> Your dad's a right raver. Ugh. Passion, Lawrence, think passion. Let it ooze from every pore. Are you sure he's not the entertainer? <laughs> and now for my pièce de résistance. Ooh, is that my actual dad? <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, Lawrence. Oh. Oh. Sorry, uh, I think I need to sit this one out. How many has he put away? Only a couple of sips, that's all. Okay, let's have a look at you. That's all right, I think we've got it. Thank you, Emma. Fine. Let me know if you want a medical professional instead of a barman. Oh, I need to get you home. Come on, right. Are you sure now? Mm -hmm. right. Please. My name. What does that matter? It's about Lawrence White, home farm, Emmerdale. Uh, someone's messed around with his heart pills. If he doesn't take them, he could die. Yeah! Well, hello there, Daisy. Get those big artists over oh, here. Oh. <laughs> I almost fancy him myself. No steers in my saloon, cowboy. Shouldn't those cups be here by now? Yep. I'm on it. 